Yes, lads, welcome to another custom tactics video on the channel today. We are taking a look at one of my favorites, the 4334. Let's get into it. For cheap, safe, and reliable FC24 coins, check out MMO EXP in the description down below and use my creator code ALP at checkout for a cheeky 5% off. Jeez. So, diving in with the player instructions, lads, and as you can see, it's set out on your screen like so. A balanced on the defensive style, width on 40, depth on 60. The trusty 40-60 combo from FIFA 23. We do love it, lads. Uh, balanced and direct passing. Um, best in the game, lads. If you're looking to push on for those better ranks in team of the season foot champs, then you need this. Width on 40. We do like to tuck those wingers in ever so slightly. Um, it, just give, it, it just keeps those passing options nice and tight through the middle. Players in the box on six. Uh, corners, three free kicks, two. Did you know 84% of people watching this video right now are not subscribed to the channel? So if you are enjoying, remember to leave a like and sub to the channel if you are new. So diving in with the player instructions, lads, and we're going to start with the striker, obviously. Um, and for me, that's Ronaldo. Stay central only. Um, nothing else. I'm, I'm not a fan of getting behind or um, anything else. The stay forwards okay because you do want him to have top of his work way to high low so we're just going to stay there anyways but you just want your best best forward in this position for me cristiano ronaldo there's nothing there's no one close he is obscene um but that might be mbappe for you that might be eusebio that might be thierry Henry. there are so many good strikers in this game lads just to use your favorite and best goal scorer in this position so the wingers are on similar but slightly different instructions um, the right winger for me is on come back on defense, stay wide and get into the box with crosses. And the left winger is on cut inside, come back on defense and get into the box with crosses. So they're all going to get into the box and support with the play when we're when we're in the final third. But when we're in that like midfield area, St. Maximan is going to stay wide and create the width on this side. Um, again, you want good technical ability in these positions as well as great pace. Um, and then Xavi Simmons is just on cut inside. And a lot of my tactics recently have had this kind of cut inside mechanic where you link it with the fullback, um, which we'll get on to in a second. But it's nice to have a player, two players that have got good pace, like I say Maxman got electric pace. And to be honest, if you had electric pace in both these positions, that is ideal. Um, I like more some, the, the guy I have cut inside, I prefer him to be more like a technically gifted like cam um, obviously javi simmons 84 rated but we've put him into that 99 shooting evo so for him his speciality for me is cutting inside and scoring those finesse shot pluses to the far post which is what he's in the team to do and he does it unbelievably well um but i say maximum stretch to play on stay wide and you just want a left footer on the left hand side and a right footer on the right hand side and that's same max man he is five star weak foot so we could play either side and javi simmons he's got finesse shot plus so we give him the pass and he's allowed to be on the left hand side so if you are going to have someone on the left hand side that's right footed i recommend you have they have at least silver finesse shot they don't need to have finesse shot plus if they have finesse shot regular it does help a lot lads because you can score those finesse shot goals um because javi simmons is cut inside now this is where i thought i'd explain this one a bit sooner than towards the end of the video but um because javi simmons is cut inside it allows space for our attacking fullback to go forward so what will happen is he'll cut inside and almost drag that fullback with him as they track him inside rolf over us will be creating the width on balance and overlap um and again lads it's important to create width on both sides so because we got him on cut inside we are lacking width on the left so having that attacking fullback fill that void while we're while we're attacking is amazing and you do overload this right hand this left hand side when you do that so you've got an overload on the left with javi simmons cutting inside on a finesse shot plus um on his strong foot so that's danger for the opposition there so they've got to focus on that and after you fire a few of them that little icon pops up above your head a few times or you score one or two they'll start panicking when this guy starts coming inside which will leave rolfo in acres of space and often with the way this works the way the the cut inside works you got lots of lots of space for rolfo anyways because st maximan is on stay wide um this fullback is just stay back while attacking and overlap so it's a defensive fullback in this position 
So we don't need a fallback creating the width on this side because say Maxman will be creating the width. Um, you can flip this lad. So if you want your right back to go forward, you just need your right wing to be on cut inside and then your left back will be stay back on attacking and then your left wing will be on stay wise. So you can flip it quite easily. The center cam lads is just on getting to the boss crosses. Um, I have experimented with free roam and it is good, um, but I like a bit more consistency in the positioning so I can work patterns of play. Um, but yeah, but just get into the boss crosses and this player is going to play like your your creator, your, obviously your cam. Um, but they are going to pop up a lot in the box for you to score some goals. So Patalis scores a lot of goals for me, obviously team here Patalis. Vanessa Shot Plus is a bonus, but she's five star, five star and probably the best player in this position in the game. But you can use whoever you want in this, lads. I do recommend that you just use an out-and-out -out creator goal scorer in this position. Focus more on passing play styles, as well as having decent finishing. You can get away with having, like, mid-80s finishing or shooting if you've got, like, really good passing play styles. But ideally, you just want a really rounded creator cam. A, a card that some of you may have to have a play this position really well is that um is that showdown Zhao felix he plays this position really well the two center mids are both on stay on the edge of the box with crosses cover center and stay back while attacking now they do push on sometimes especially javi because he's high high um but for the most part they do listen to the instructions they stay on the edge of the box and it's good because what they'll do i like to have two anchors in midfield that not so much they're, def they're there to defend, but I like it in them there to dictate the play. So that's the reason why they stay on the edge of the box. I don't want them pushing on. I want them to be there and just controlling the pace of the game, controlling the balls going out left and right and having someone with long ball plus like Xavi. Insane lads. One of the best box-to-box -box midfielders in the game. Super, super underrated. And Marquez, we're playing in midfield lads. He's got great defensive play styles, great physicals. He's insane. So I recommend you have a creator and more of a bruiser. So if you have that new Xiaomeni, he'll work in this position. If you've got something like that Vieira, he'll work. Um, there's plenty of big boy midfielders you can put in this position, but I recommend them have some good defending stats, good defending play styles, and um, half decent on the ball. Lads. You do want them to be able to create a little bit for you. And then this guy, you just want an out-to-out -out box box-to-box creator. His defensive, his defensive attributes aren't the best. He's, he's decent, don't get me wrong, but he's not amazing. Um, but his main job in the team is to create, and then he's there to obviously push up the pitch and dictate the pace for us. Centre-backs, touch them. I will find you. You know I will, unless you are dunking on your opposition like this. <laughs> I've got really good at scoring those front post headers, lads. Like crazy good it's it's so it's so fun and honestly i'm working on a custom tactics video not custom tactics sorry a set piece video to release soon so stay tuned for that and then goalkeeper lads is just unbalanced that is all we're just trying to limit the ai involvement and that's the 4334 lads leave in the comments if you use it and i'll catch you in another one Jeez.